Well, this Christmas going to be unlike most others that people have experienced before many families not able to be together because of travel restrictions and social distancing because of the pandemic. Five News reporter Catherine Gilker spoke to a technology specialist about how even the least tech savvy person can stay connected. I don't think anyone knew what Zoom was this time last year, but now we all do. Uh, so like again, we're wandering around this store and we're seeing that there's uh, so many options for us. Stuart Reed was in Best Buy Monday seeing what they needed to upgrade their technology for their virtual Christmas. He lives in Fayetteville but is from London, England. We want to try and make the Christmas uh, uh, as normal as it usually is. Normally my parents will travel over here and spend Christmas with us, but now they can't do that. We're looking at ways of setting up a camera or setting up a laptop or setting up an iPhone so we can just uh, have them watch them unwrap the presents. From FaceTime on your iPhone or iPad to Zoom on any device with the camera, there are so many ways to connect. Technology experts say most are as simple as answering a phone call, making it easy for people who aren't tech savvy. If you can already use some form of technology, we can usually walk you through how to use um, some of this newer technology. Um, a lot of companies like Google and Amazon have made it a point to make their products really innovative and easy to use so that everyone can use them. Jasmine Carroll is a computer supervisor at Best Buy in Little Rock. She says there are so many options for people to connect virtually, and while most of these products aren't new, everyone's focus has changed to the cameras on the technology because that's now their most important feature for many people. A lot of people are missing a lot of that human interaction um, that they're so used to, and so helping them kind of mend that um, and find ways to still be able to celebrate has been really great. It's been nice to see a lot of people smiling and happy that although there's a lot of things going on, they're still able to find some joy. In Fayetteville, covering news where you live, Katherine Gilker, 5 News. Uh, if you plan to use Zoom on Christmas, the company is lifting its time limit for, for free accounts from December 23rd to the 26th, and then again from December 30th through January 2nd.